Hello, I'm Julie Joy of the Young Lightworkers, and I have a message from Mira from the Palladian High Council, channeled through Valerie Donner on March 7th, 2018. She says, greetings, I am Mira from the Palladian High Council. My full focus now is on the Earth's ascension with my work and the Earth Council. On the Earth Council, we observe all that is going on with your planet, around your planet, and within your planet. We are determined to see you and the Earth through your ascension. There is much at stake, and we want to reassure you that you are doing an excellent job. If you could only see the extent of the beautiful work that you are doing, you would be astounded. Much of your work is done in the dream state as well as throughout the day, even if you are unaware of it. You are such higher dimensional beings that you are present only to a small extent in your physical form. This is perfectly acceptable and necessary for this is a big project to rearrange everything on the earth. Your lives are valuable beyond measure. Your hearts are prepared and open for a whole new way of life. Your souls are finely tuned to what is most necessary for you to do every single day. For many of you, your primary focus is on the ascension. You are primed to want to know as much as you can about the progress that is being made. Unfortunately, you cannot receive this information from your mainstream media. We have already discussed this. It is often important to simply follow your own knowingness to show you where to go for up-to-the-date important truthful information. Most of you are pretty good at this by using your intuition. More information is forthcoming from those divine communicators who receive excellent input from the higher realms. Right now, it is important for you to take excellent care of yourselves and to love yourselves. What you think and do matters. You are at the apex of the final decline of the dark forces. Their demise is accelerating like a snowball rolling down a mountain. The dragon's tail of karma is whipping around wherever necessary and there is no stopping it. In other words, there is nowhere to run and nowhere to hide for these evil ones. Their time is complete. You will begin to recognize how much lighter the planet is feeling as the percentage of light grows stronger. More of humanity are beginning to awaken. For some, this awareness is earth-shattering, for it means that their lives have been lived in fantasy, some of which has been more like a nightmare. They are beginning to see through the deceit of the mainstream media. They are questioning everything and are looking deeper for truth. Little by little, all will be revealed until it becomes an explosion of truth and light. From there, it will only be forward movement. The light beings left on the planet will have important, big, bold, new assignments. For most of you, the third dimension has lost its luster. It can be challenging having to go through your third dimensional paces, acting as if everything is normal, like the way it used to be. You already know this is not true. Some of you are anxious to begin living your fifth dimensional lives. You are ready for love and unity, peace, abundance, and joy. Please be reassured that you are being directed in your appropriate spiritual path. It is an exciting time of chaos and change. It precedes evolution. It is about beautiful new creation. You are the microcosms of the macrocosm. So in your lives know that as you transcend whatever challenge that is set before you, you are doing it for everyone. You must be strong and courageous. Stand up to the challenges, whether it is dark attacks, old patterns within that need to be cleared, health issues, lack, or fear. Change is the norm now. Go with the flow, and you will be quickly stepping up the ascension ladder. 
I love and respect all of you. I am Mira. Once again, this was channeled by Valerie Donner on March 7th, 2018. Her website is thegroundcrew.com. This was presented on the Sananda.website. My name is Julie Joy of the Young Lightworkers, and I love this beautiful message from Mira.